Number 22. One, two. <laughs> Step aboard, please, madam, and I'll pass the children across. What about my husband? I'm sorry, women and children first. Yes, my dear, I think you better have. But in a small boat like that, I can't go without my husband. That lady's right. It's absolutely madam, I you. ridiculous. Kindly help me out of here, please. It can't be helped if she won't go. Now, madam, please. Now, would you be good enough to step into the boat, please, madam? Catch my death of cold? Certainly not. Would you step into the boat, please, madam? Thank you. Eileen! Eileen! Yes? You won't get back on board tomorrow without a pass. <laughs> <laughs> but I don't see what I have my orders, ladies and gentlemen. The ladies are certainly safely, sir. The non in boats. The captain's opinion about that is different, sir. Look here, sir. I don't know whether you gentlemen have noticed that, but uh, this ship has gotten quite a list on it now. Whoa. That's not right. Well, I don't suppose that's very really serious. You can't sink this boat. That's quite so. Get a move on. Come on, lads. Come on, move along there. What's the use, Chief? Whoa, whoa. All the pumps in Belfast would never keep that water down. That may be so, but the longer we can keep her afloat, the more lives will be saved. So put your backs into it. Oh, sorry, sir. sorry. Strangers. Martins, there's a job for you. Aren't you going up top, sir? Presently. Open up all the spare cabins. Take out all the life belts and spare blankets and get your men to distribute them. The blankets to the boats. Right, sir. I'll see you through at once. Good. Oh, Mr. Andrews. Yes? I'd like you to tell me something. I... I have a wife and three children on board. Just how serious is it? I'm not the panicking kind. The ship has about an hour to live. A little more if some of the upper bulkheads hold, but not much more. Get your wife and children into the boats. Thank you. Oh, well, Mr. Andrews. I take it you and I may both be in the same boat later. Yes. We may. Oh, this way, madam. This way, please. As quickly as you can. Straight the way down there. Please, will you tell me what's going on, Robert? People have been rushing about and noises overhead. Well, it's very tiresome. We've struck an iceberg and damaged the ship. We may be a day late getting to New York. Oh, that is annoying. And to make matters worse, the the captain's being very fussy and correct. All women and children have to go up on deck and get into the lifeboats. Oh, no. Oh, afraid so, dear. But I don't want to wake the children. Is it really necessary? Yes. I think we should do what the captain says. Very well, Robert. We, we must wrap the children up warmly. We can take the blankets off the beds, too. I can deal with Tom if you look after the girls. Yes, all right. Tom. Tom. Come on, old boy. You've got to get up now. Yes. Sorry. Jennifer. There we are. Wake up, darling. There's the boy. Come on! Come on! Oh, quick! Onto it! Quick, lads! The boat head's going! Ah! 